Hi, this is Patrick Walsh here with the Louisiana National Guard Recon Report. I'm here with Hunter Lee and Carlos Henderson talking about how the offense is going to get better. Struggled a little bit in the first scrimmage, but they've been working hard this week getting ready for Oklahoma. First, we'll go to Hunter Lee. Hunter, you're finally a senior on this team, and obviously, again, the offense didn't have what they wanted to produce during the scrimmage. What have you done since then to make the offense as a better unit? Well, as for myself, you know, I expect uh, to bring juice every day to the team. And uh, when I mean juice, I mean energy, passion, um, really just a way to bring energy to the team and the offense so we can make plays. And uh, that's really all it takes is guys to make plays and get everybody going. So the offense, you know, starts rolling, everybody starts clicking. And um, really right now, it's, it's not a matter of fact if we're making plays, it's really just getting that energy and compassion uh, to really play hard and go every single play. Now, Carlos Henderson, the one thing the wide receivers really want to bring to the to the football field this year is speed. And I think you and Paul Turner, a lot of the newer players, are going to be able to do that. Do you think your speed uh, has what it takes, along with, with Paul Turner, to stretch the field and, and allow the offense to click at a higher level? I, to be honest, I think everyone, every receiver um, has the speed to stretch the offense. You know, we come, we come out every practice, work hard, you know, get better. We, we worked hard during the summer doing winter, winter workouts, so I think everyone has a big chance to, to spread the field and make good plays this year. Back to Hunter. Hunter, this is finally your senior season, your swan song, your chance to really step up and also be a leader on this team, both on the field and off the field. Coming into this camp, what did you think about doing to prepare yourself to be a leader on this team this year? Um, you know, really, I, uh, I stress myself as, as much as I ever have. You know, I, I expected myself to be up here um, you know, to be that guy when, you know, he doesn't want to yell in practice, that guy who just doesn't have the energy to uh, say anything, to, to, you know, really push myself to do that, you know, to be somebody that uh, gets guys going and um, really pushes, you know, guys on the team to, you know, take it to a whole nother level. And uh, you know, that's really what I've been stressing myself this camp uh, to do is just to make this team better so that we can win games. Carlos. The wide receivers graduated four players last year, but uh, you've got a chance to really step up and be a better unit as a whole this year. Do you think you guys as a position group are going to be better on the field? Um, yes, sir. I'm excited about this year. You know, I think um, we should do some very nice things. You know, we have some dangerous receivers inside and outside, so I think it should be a good, wonderful season for the receiver for this year. And back to Hunter for the final question, Hunter. September 11th. North Texas Denton, very, very close to home, Flower Mound for you. How excited are you to, you get to do it last year against Army in the Cotton Bowl, but how excited are you to one last game in your home city, your home area, play in front of your uh, high school friends and family? Oh, it's going to be awesome. You know, I love those games, especially, uh, you know, guys that you went to school with, going to school at UNT, and, uh, you know, guys that I've actually played with are playing on the team. So that's always fun, playing against guys I know. And, uh, you know, there's always a little trash talk, and uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. So I'm really excited to go back home and uh, get to play in front of the family. Again, here with Hunter Lee and Carlos Henderson, I'm Patrick Walsh with your Louisiana National Guard Recon Report. Remember, Oklahoma on August 30th, number three Sooners, the Bulldogs of Louisiana Tech. Pay-per-view, check your local listings for game times and order information.